Hey, Chad German here. I'm going to do a video real quick on the difference between a feeder and a branch circuit. In order to do that, I'm going to use the example of a hot tub. According to 680.13, we have to have a disconnect to turn off the conductors for a hot tub within sight, which is according to Article 100 is 50 feet, or and no, sorry, and no closer than five feet. So there's two different type of installations. Uh, that you can do here. And it's the same installation but different components which would change this feed as a, either a feeder or a branch circuit. So let's look at this one. This is a branch circuit. The definition of a branch circuit is from the last overcurrent protection device to the utilization equipment or the outlet and I'm very I'm, I'm paraphrasing that. So you see here I got a GFI breaker and then it goes to a disconnect and from there to a hot tub. That makes that a branch circuit because my last overcurrent protection device is here at the sub panel. Um, so this would be a branch circuit because the entire run there is on the load side or the back side of that overcurrent protection device. Okay. Now down here this becomes a feeder because now a feeder is between my my panel and another and my uh, my final overcurrent protection device. And there's some other stuff there in Article 100 when it comes to feeders with separately derived systems. I would check that out. But let's check out this. We got a breaker. It's not GFI protected that now feeds a SPA disconnect. Now you can go to your local hardware sport store and buy a, a disconnect or a SPA disconnect that has GFI protection. That disconnect GFI protected is also your last overcurrent protection device. That would make this my feeder and then my branch circuits would come from that final overcurrent protection to my hot tub. So same style of installation. This GFI breaker is also my a disconnect. I can turn that on and off. That's why you can do the bo both of these. I'm going to be doing a class this weekend um, on Saturday, sorry, on Friday, tomorrow, I'll be doing a class for Electrician U. Go to electricianu.com, look up the classes, and I'll be doing a class according to 210, which is Brent Circuits, uh, not according, on 210, on 225, which is outside Brent Circuits feeders, and 215, which is feeders. I'll be doing an awesome class teaching me the codes associated with these two types of installations. This is just one example um, for that. A feeder generally is a little bit different than a, a branch circuit and I want to go over those things. So go to uh, electricianu.com and look up the class for tomorrow, branch circuits and feeder. Sign up and we're going to have a great class.